Good morning everybody, I'm Barry and I'm going to be showing you how to use Unique. Um, the first thing I usually do in the morning is put on my foundation, my blush, and this mascara. It's the dollar store brand. It's called Big Bold Curl NYC. It's nothing special. Just a simple go-to mascara look. These are my eyes on this mascara. Next, I'm going to use these two. They're my favorite. The brand new 3D Fiber Last Mascaras. This one is the gel that you put on before you put on any of the fibers. And this one is, of course, the fibers. And then you put this one on at the end to seal in all the fibers so they don't fly all over your crease. I also love to use the Moodstruck Precision Pencil in white on the corner of my eyes so it opens them up and makes them look more wide, I guess. Let's start off with this. Just draw a little bit in the corner of my eyes. I'm not a makeup artist. I just kind of do my own thing. I don't know if you can see difference, but I definitely can. I feel like my eyes look a little bit wider. Um, this is, of course, the one I was just doing it on. I feel like my eyes look a little wider. bit on the other eye. There we go. And it opens up my eyes just a teeny bit. And the next thing I'm going to use is the gel. Now you want to have both of these open at the same time because you need to put the fibers on as quick as possible. That way they stick because otherwise they're not going to stick and it's going to look all clumpy and gross. And you don't want none of that. You want to get as much as you can on the tips of your lashes. Of course, my lashes are super short, so I love putting them on the tips of my lashes. It helps them elongate and look longer. I gotta put the fibers on before it seals and stops working and sticking. Of course, this is my favorite step. So as you can tell, they're starting to already get huge. Give me a half a second while I go and find my lash brush. So this is my e.l.f. Professional Brown Brow Comb and Brush. And I just use this to make sure there are no clumps. And thin out my lashes. 
storage, but I already have this ready in case I do change mint. And if I just fall off, I've been holding this up for so long. And of course, just seal the mint. I'm gonna make sure you seal them in really well. So this right here will start falling off. I don't have any lashes left on the other. I'm gonna put some of this on the bottom lashes and then I'll show you guys some results. I don't like to put the fibers on the bottom lashes. My first coat because I'm going out for the day. I really don't need super duper long extravagant lashes on the bottom of my lashes. So this, of course, is the first coat of the 3D. I absolutely love this mascara. It's definitely a difference. You can see it. <laughs> now let's go ahead and put it on the other eye. And this is just the one coat of 3D Fiber Lash on both of my lashes. Absolutely love this mascara. It's beautiful. I'm gonna put on another coat and I'll be right back. Sorry about the pause. My alarm went off so it decided that it was going to stop the video. But these are my lashes after the second coat. And I hope you think this mascara is as amazing as I do. Because this mascara makes my eyelashes amazing. And they are so super short, so not even funny. You guys have a good day. Bye.